My name's Tom. I studied the Access to Medicine course in Stafford and I'm currently in second year at Keele Medical School. Before I started at Stafford, I was an actor for about 15 years before that, so working in a very different industry, in creative arts industry. I actually rang Keele Medical School, because I lived down the road, came in and had a chat with somebody at the admissions team and it was they who told me about the Access course. Returning to education as an adult was always going to be difficult, it's going to be interesting. I think I was probably quite apprehensive when I started the Access course, because I was thinking that I was too old for it. I was worried about how I'd make a living and how I'd keep earning and how I'd keep the house and the mortgage payments and everything else. And I think that's one of the reasons why the Access course is so good because they are flexible to enable you to continue earning some money, fitting in your other commitments, children and family, teaching you that you're going to need to commit. And that's a really hard balance to find is giving of yourself to the course and committing yourself psychologically and intellectually to the course whilst at the same time maintaining those commitments. Studying at Stafford was really good in the sense that it enabled me to transition from not being in full-time education to being in probably more than full-time education at medical school. When I was thinking about returning to study, I don't think I really knew what to expect. When I got there, I found that it was challenging in that the depth of the work and the scientific knowledge that you go to was I think more complex than I was expecting but the support networks were in place helped with that. The course is designed to be taught to adults and I think that really helps because I think when you're returning to education you learn in a different way initially at least. It gives you as, a, as an adult coming into education from a non-scientific background it gives you a scientific vocabulary that enables you to then engage when you get to medical school and just follow something of what's going on. I apply to Keele Medical School and Manchester Medical School, both of whom use the MMI system, multiple mini interviews. The advantage of the MMI is that it's standardised for all applicants, part of values-based recruitment. They are looking for people who have empathy, who have communication skills, regardless of what your age is or what your background is. Don't be ashamed of what you've done in the past there can be a temptation to pretend that the person that you were before is gone and that you are now this student person who is about to be a doctor and it's a change of identity, it certainly was for me. And I think that's not necessary. I think part of what's going to make you a good clinician is to embrace your experiences, embrace the skill set that that's brought you and bring that with you to your application. The change from college to university was difficult. I didn't have much confidence when I started the Access course. I didn't know if I would have the capacity to learn and the neuroplasticity and old dog new tricks. And then studying at Stafford, where the education was tailored towards adult learners, that gave me such confidence, gave me a real confidence boost, which is a really good thing. But it also enabled me to learn in an environment where I can ask silly questions. I felt comfortable to ask the tutors the most basic of questions for things that I'd missed. Working at the Access course enabled me to figure out how to study again. And I think it helped me to develop my own strategies, my own techniques, and to take responsibility for my own learning, which is something that is invaluable when you're in medical school. Probably most importantly of all, gives you the confidence that you do have the capability and the capacity to come on to an incredibly complex degree course and do well. Then you'll find once you get there, you're actually fine. You are able to keep up and all the things that you were worried about before, they don't really matter anymore. But what you've done is you have empowered yourself. You've given yourself that opportunity to completely change the way that your life and your family's lives are going to be henceforth. That's an incredibly brave thing to do, but it's also incredibly important and hugely empowering. So I would say go for it.